Hi, I'm the founder of Being Delicious, Not Being Delicious. My name is Bean, aka Raver Bean. I started Being Delicious four years ago um, as an online boutique with one of my friends. Um, unfortunately, my friend quit in the middle because um, of some personal matters. But I still continue running the online business. Um, and I reformed the whole image of Be Nalicious to more edgy and louder. And then I got quite a lot of good feedbacks from my customers. And they keep asking me like, where is the shop? And do you have a shop? That's the reason um, why I decided to open a boutique with my sister, Miki. Pretty much most of the accessories in my store are DIY. Um, not 100%, but 80% of them are DIY. And most of them are one and only. And yeah, I just launched my very first collection called Red and Fab few days ago and I got like so many good feedbacks I, and I'm really happy with that. My collection is made of the fabric that I brought from Japan and Indonesia. So it's you know one and only and they are so precious. What makes me want to make my own collection is because what I'm looking for is really hard for me to find in KL and even when I travel to overseas I can't find anything like what I expect to you know, look for. So I decided to make my own. And my style, as you can see, is very loud. It's very colourful. I'm not going to say colour is my life, but I think you need a little colour to make your life happen. I am having a hard time to, you know, for running this business because what I'm selling in my store is pretty much non-mainstream items. I consider lucky because I got a permanent job as a baby clothing designer so that I can get the salary to support my little dream. How the passerby look at my store? They stop and they stare, they make fun of my dummy, they make fun of my, my accessories. Like, oh, you see, look at this. This is so creepy and this looks so stupid on you. Um, I dare you to wear this on the streets, blah, 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 you know. It's pretty annoying. I can't stand that anymore. I feel so sorry for the passerby that making fun of my stuff. Why? Because they are really like lack of the fashion knowledge and their acceptance level is pretty low. I realized that people who know trend doesn't mean that they know what fashion is. For an example, like crop top is the trend now. A lot of girls, they buy crop top and they style the crop top is like really, really, really so raw. But hey, look at me. I still look fashionable without my crop top on. I don't give a shit of the latest trend. I only wear things that make me look fantastic and I comfortable with. The point of fashion is don't be a fashion slave. Wear what you like and be who you are.